Hey everybody, so today we are going to be doing a video of my Spirit Halloween 2023 in Minecraft. Now before we start, if you notice, the outside of this building I think is really cool. Like, I put like these lights out here. I got, even these are supposed to be like the window posters. I made the, the building actually yellow and orange. Just like Spirit. It's colors. And I also made the doors purple. Uh, there's nothing really special to see on the, uh outside or like the size of the store but there's that side that's basically what it looks like on the other side oh yeah and i kind of made a jack the reaper up there it was not a thing it was a, it was my design i didn't take it from anybody i know it kind of looks off center but it, jack the reaper is kind of off center so yeah or not off center but like his face is like off center but i know but anyways let's go on in uh so, okay, so before we do, like, the theme, uh, we're going to look at the uh, filler section. So, so we have a little Jack Carver right here. He looks okay. I, I kind of, may, uh, maybe I kind of wish I did straw, like, right here instead of, like, this weird terracotta block. But I think it looks good with the pumpkin, blue banner, and, like, like his, like, yeah. So, yeah. And I know Heckles really isn't filler, but I put Heckles here. I think this Heckles design is actually really good. I think there's his shoes, you know, part of his outfit. The orange honey thing is kind of part of his outfit. Even says 10 cents. And he even has a balloon. I did that in Education Edition. Also, this is Little Jack Carver's box. Oh, uh, Heckles' box. Okay. So here's Emelyn. I, uh, so this is Emelyn's box right here. I actually really like Emelyn's design. I kind of made it to where she goes far, so yeah. And I, I, I couldn't really get much for the face. I probably should have done a skull. I don't know why I did like an iron bar, but yeah. And this design I really do like, so obviously this is the cauldronous box. But this is the cauldronous. Now, if you notice, I have fog. And this thing is supposed to be like the potion. Uh, I think the pig head was like fine. Her face is kind of weird, so I guess it makes sense. And I made the fog with, like, a, putting a little campfire under the underneath. So, yeah. The cauldron doesn't have water in it. It's just a fog. But, you know, it's really cool. I think it looks really good. So, yeah. Oh, uh, let's look at, like, the side stuff before we look at the theme. So, okay. So, this is, like, the line up here. So, in case you're wondering what all this nonsense right here is... Uh, this is supposed to represent people's, like, name. So, you know how they have, like, the spirit of children, like, they have the names? That's what these are supposed to be. I'm in education, I'm in education edition because I wanted the, I, it, you gave a little more creativity, like, with this stuff, and I was able to make Heckle's balloon. So, yeah, that's why I'm in education edition, but, yeah. Uh, but, also, I put Dylan here, yeah. Um, but yeah, this is just the stuff in the line, so this is, these is, like, supposed to be, like, the trick-or-treat bags. I guess these are supposed to be, like, the bag clips, like, these are supposed to be the spirit bag clips. This is, these things are just, like, random stuff they put. Same with these, you know, like, the pens, the weird gel thingies. Yeah. Uh, okay, so let's go, the, okay, so... Okay, so right here. So uh, these are like supposed to be blankets. And so are these supposed to be blankets. These are also supposed to be blankets. And what these things that stick up are just side steppers, you know, those things. Um, and back here, oh yeah, back here I think I did really good. So you have like the mask section. I think it looks really good. But you also have, like, the skulls. Uh, I think these are just, like, the weapon boxes they have. You know how they have, like, the weapon boxes? Yeah. More skulls. Skulls. Weapons. I think these are supposed to be random things, like the chicken that they have. Uh, I think it's supposed to be, like, the weird other hats they have, like, right there. And, uh, these are, you know how they have, like, accessory, like, makeup accessories? That's what these dyes are for. And all these costumes, or these are just supposed to be costumes. These are supposed to be, like, the weird costumes. So, like, you know, the couple costumes. 
you know, like the avocado and toast, peanut butter jelly. Yeah. Again, these are just costumes. Um, and before we look at the theme, uh, we're going to look at the boxes on the floor. So, this is a Martian Warrior box. You know, it has like yellow. This is a uh, Daldy box. This is a Hellspawn box. Stilts box. Poor George box. Uh, Little Jack Carver box. These two are supposed to be uh, Leatherface. And that's slim. Oh, and this one. Oh, yeah, it was Hellspawn. That's right. Okay, uh, so right here we have. This is a slim box, another slim box, and a Martian Warrior box. Uh, yes, I did color the license boxes since they're like color. Yeah. And then this. Set, uh, the Widow. And it's just the Widow. Over here we have a Gordo. Uh, Eternal Rest. Eternal Rest. Wait. Oh, Howling Spirit. A Gordo. What's this one? Oh, Dagger Mike. Uh, Howling Spirit. Dagger Mike. These are supposed to be the ones that aren't going to sell, like, at all. Little Jack Carver. Dagger Mike. Howling Spirit. Right here is a Martian Warrior box. Eternal Rest. Gordo. Okay, that's just Gordo. Eternal Rest. Howling Spirit. And I believe, yeah, that's Howling Spirit. Uh, these are just two slim boxes. Uh, so this, I think these, wait, what are these, wait, oh, these are just random boxes, I didn't put anything in these, I think I just, these are, okay, I'm just gonna say these are, like, the skeleton things, you know, like, the skeleton boxes, yeah, and then this is a Martian box, but anyways, let's go up front, since we're done with all, like, the side boxes and whatnot, also, I did make, like, a back room, I made, like, the entrances to the back room, uh, just put, like, random boxes back here. You know, random boxes. Other random boxes. An entrance to the store from the back. You know. Random boxes. Random boxes. And the back here is kind of just a way for, like, the back room. Yeah. Now we're just going to speed through this. Kind of just a way to get around it. I'm not going to put anything in here since it's... Yeah. Oh, and then back here, kind of does another one of these. Goes here, here. Okay, and then this is just a room full of random boxes. This is another entrance to the store. And I believe if you come back here... Okay, well, there's... Yeah, there's more random boxes. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, and we have one more, like, thing on the side to show. Um... Obviously, these are like the kids' costumes. It's not really a difference. And oh, yeah, I put these like posters up here to represent, like, you know, like the posters on the like wall. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is the jumping spider section. Uh, oh, yeah, this is just slim box because they always have like a box here, I feel like. So, yeah. And then I didn't make Ghost Wing since it's kind of a boring design to make. So, yeah. But yeah, these are just a bunch of drumming spiders. Nothing really special. Okay, now we're going to finally get to the theme. It's been nine minutes. We haven't even covered, like, the theme part. So let's cover stilts first. So stilts here, I actually used, like, I don't know, like prismarine stairs and, like, purple concrete. I used white candles for the bowling pins. I might, I should have just done a normal candle. I also did black concrete and I did a skull. Uh, let's look at the theme. So I made smooth stone. Most of the theme is made out of smooth stone and uh, whatever this thing is called. I also have like the lanterns, lanterns. Yeah. Here we got Leatherface. We got the buzz saws. We also have lapis for like his outfit and then, you know, human face since that's really what it is. It's basically, it's really symmetrical. It's basically the exact same from the other side. Uh, these, like, are supposed to be, like, the gargoyle thingies up there. Yeah. And it says Spirit Hollow Cemetery. I decided to use hanging signs. I thought it would look cool. 
Well, up here we got the Martian guy. Um, I mean, you know, black concrete. Um, like cyan concrete. I thought it was cyan and black, but no, it's just cyan with like a weird shadowing. And I used this stair. I used a goat horn to look like the gun. I think it looks kind of like a gun. And I used the creeper face because I feel like that's the most like alien face. And behind him, I made like the window. Yeah. Let's go over here to the uh, widow. So, yeah. So this is kind of how I made like the one with like the fence. Not too creative. Whatever. I also put like the torches there. Widow was kind of a hard one to think about. This is kind of her head right here. Like, that's her face. My item frame. Yeah, this is probably my least favorite one of my designs. It's really not great. It's pretty easy to make. So, yeah. I don't really like my Widow. But, you know, yeah. The slim side. This this part of the theme is also really symmetrical. Uh, it's just, yeah. Same on each side. But this is... A little different than this, obviously, but yeah. But yeah, it's a window thing. I, this is slim, so I used pink concrete. Uh, the, whoa, I did not mean to enter the boat. Uh, the boat is supposed to be like the bag. Let's push, push the boat a little bit. Or, uh, let's push it. There, ah! Actually, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I used a cyan button and a skull. Uh, I think that's pretty good for a slim. I also made bedrock for, like, the black and white part. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, these are, like, the windows that say, like, 40 in the star. I didn't put that, but, yeah. Poor George. Now, even though I don't like poor George as a prop, I really like my design for poor George. I know he's more of a green, but this looks kind of more like the color. So, I used bamboo wood. And I used the skeleton skull. So, yeah. I use them upside down because I think that's more interesting. But, yeah. The window. Again, yeah. Uh, so, right here we just have, like, the side where it shows, like, the plaques. So, there's, I don't know if you can see that, but Henry Hustle. This one up here says Cerberus. And then that one says Ophelia. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see it. Right here it says Grim, and this is supposed to be like his arm, you know, he has like his arm. Yeah, I could have put more animatronics on like these, but I decided not to. Uh, here's Nightcrawler, Buzzsaw, I didn't put like the stuff under it that says like, why the long face or whatever. Uh, this one, Hugs, and then this one says Menacing Molly. Yeah, let's look at the themes, or the props now. So those are the other gargoyle things, and I also put torches, and it's the same on the other side, gargoyles and the torches. Dagger Mike, I actually think is a really good design. We got, I forget, cherry wood, I think. Yeah, cherry wood, and then we have like a button, and a quartz block, and a skull. I think Dagger Mike looks pretty good. And then my scary sitting scarecrow design is no different than the normal sitting scarecrow design. So, yeah. Now let's come over to the back theme, which I think looks really good. So obviously we have Hellspawn right here. It's the exact same way I built Mr. Dark last year. Yeah. Um. Yeah, like I said, I just used these two things. I just put a bunch of tombstones everywhere because to make it more like a graveyard. And I know this is supposed to be like Lord Raven Tombstone, the other tombstone. And this is Howling Spirit. I think Howling Spirit's okay. I mean, there's not much I can do, but yeah. It's like the pole thing. Oh, this is the gargoyle right here. Looks pretty good. I mean, yeah. Kinda, I kind of had a lazy gargoyle design. All the gargoyles are the exact same design. This is like the entryway. I should have put it through the whole thing, but I think it looks fine. Uh, here we have Darling Dolly, which is one of my favorite designs. So, yeah. And Eternal Rest. Um, yeah. And then Gordo over here, I think is pretty good. I wish there was like a small pumpkin head, but it's still okay. So, yeah. 
the black heart there's no lighting in here but i think the black heart looks pretty good you got the like ava and the black heart here we have grave watcher again i just put random tombstones back here i don't I know, I don't think I put no, okay, but yeah, Grave Watcher I think is pretty good, obviously I put red candles, uh, yeah, Grave Watcher is pretty good, I think I really love my Desmondus design, Desmondus has got to be my favorite design, cause like here's his like his bat, like body, and then here's like his wings, I used banners, and then I used a piglin head, cause I think it looks pretty good, uh, my skelly bones design is no different than last year. I just did a little banner art, a black concrete, and a skull. Oh, yeah, and uh, so that blue stuff, that's like the backdrop. I think the backdrop looks pretty good. Yeah. And if you time it right, the door is actually functional. Wait. Wait. Ah, that's okay. Not bad. Okay. That only works if you time it right, though. But, yeah. There we go. That's not bad. Yeah, not terrible. It's not great. But, yeah. Uh, this Spirit Halloween 2023, uh, I think I like. This is probably my favorite. Out of all my Spirit Halloweens. Uh, let me pause and go to, like, my 2022 one really quick. Okay, so right here, this is not my Spirit Halloween 2022 in Minecraft, but it is my Halloween City. I was going to make this Halloween City 2022, but I ended up not really doing it, so this is going to be Halloween's Halloween City for 2023. Yeah, we'll see how that turns out. It might look really good, might look really bad, you never know. But I think it'll look pretty good, so, yeah. And let's go over here to my, like, Spear Halloween for 2022. Because I said we'd look at it. And yeah. Just kind of a brief overview. But, yeah. I, I kind of made an outside for this one. I think a little better. I like the outside for this one a lot more. But, yeah. And let's go on in. I think this looks really good. But I think some of the props are a little too big. Like, Lord Raven... Uh, pump, possessed pumpkin, pog zombie. I put straw man. I kind of wish I did the photo op, and I wish I would have had like I wish I made like an outside section for all the filler props. Mr. Punchy is again way too big. Shorty as well, way too big. Tombstone Terror is pretty good. Brim's fine, I guess. Uh, these I should have just not had glowstone. Young Crouchy is probably a little big. Berries, fine. There's not much else you can do. Nozzles, I think, is fine. It looks pretty good, actually. Lucky Bottoms is, yeah, pretty good. He used to be huge, but, yeah, again, Skelly Bun's the same design. See, that's what I should have done with the ones up front, but I don't know if I was going to be able to do that. Bag of Bones, again, looks pretty good. Mr. Dark, yeah, said it's the same design. And then, like, you know, Betty Sharp, I think it's fine. Jumping Spider, it's fine. And Reagan looks pretty good. And then the walkthrough is a little, eh, but, yeah. And the side stuff for this one is kind of crammed. It's more full, which I like, but, yeah. I really like my Monty design. I think my Monty is actually really good. Again, he's just a little big. And then, like, of course, we have, like, the... And, of course, we have, like, the big top thing. And let's go over to my Spirit Halloweens from, like, 2021. So, I actually made two Spirit Halloween 2021s in Minecraft. I actually made this one in a mall. But, yeah... Um, let's go on in. I think this one's okay, but... Again, Baphomet is way too big. He should have just made, like, two blocks. Oh, I made the roof too small. Like, I... My abilities were kind of eh with how small my roof was. I shouldn't have made it in a mall, but it's fine. Mr. Howell, I guess. 
Wish I would have done an armor stand for that. Ghost face looks pretty good. Tauntress looks fine. You can't walk through here, which is kind of bad. I don't want to activate Pennywise because every time this comes up, he comes off. But yeah. Uh, Grim's fine. Nightcrawler's massive for some reason. This theme was too big. Shorty, though, is good. I mean, I like my modern one, but yeah. And then Sam's pretty good, actually. Buzzsaw, I mean, I probably should have made it a little smaller, but yeah. Punctured Pete needs to be smaller. Harriet needs to be way smaller. Henry needs to be way smaller. Beetlejuice needs to be way smaller. And I see, like, the walkthrough couldn't really be done as good because it was, like, a small roof. Also, I tried making, like, the walls, but, like, I just ended up getting really lazy and just didn't, so, yeah. And I think the back looks fine. Again, I was kind of limited to the small roof, but, you know, Evelyn Leach, it's, uh, it's big, it's too big. Ophelia's way too big. Wacky Mole's way too big. But I like that I have the hammer. Harvester of Souls is way too big. Why is the girl the same size as Harvester of Souls? Caretaker is a little big. Nightcrawler is a little fine. Eh, he's fine. A little big, though. Experiment 4 is whatever. And Mr. Dark is fine. Let's look at my uh, second Spear Halloween 2021. As you can see, my second Square Halloween 2021 looks way better. Uh, the props aren't huge. Uh, Ghostface and Hauntress are pretty good. Pennywise is way better. The Carbomatic is way better. It's also way taller. Grim is really good again. Nightcrawler is a way down the scale, way better thing. Again, Buzzsaw is way better. Um, Punctured Pete is... Probably still a little big, but I don't know really how to make it like down scale. Uh, I like Harriet because she's like upside down. Uh, Henry is a pretty good design, and then Beetlejuice, I kind of like his design with like the tombstone that he sits on. And the Carbomatic is, or not the Carbomatic, but the the walkthrough is just so much better. I think. I think it's so accurate. Yeah, I really like my 2021 here. Not my first one. Uh, this is my... Yeah, this is the shorty design I like way better. And Sam is basically the same. This looks way better, too. Yeah. And this area, I think, also looks way better with, like, Mr. Dark. I think this Experiment 4 is slightly better. Night Stalker is basically the same. Uh, but he's on the... I built the post this time. And Harvester of Souls is really good. Caretaker's kind of weird, but it's pretty good. Wacky Mole's pretty good, I think. And then, like, Evelyn Leech is way better, and so is Ophelia. Teaser for my Spirit Halloween 2018 in Minecraft. Spirit Teaser for my 2015. 2019 is pretty good, as you guys know. I really love my 2019. This part's kind of eh, but yeah. I know, I know it's only supposed to be a Spear Halloween 2023 video, but, you know, I kind of got sidetracked. Oh yeah, and this is kind of why I put it in Education Edition, so you could make a balloon. Teaser for 2016, teaser for 2020, and teaser for 2017. Alright, well, let's go back to the 2023 part, since that's really what this whole video is. So, yeah. Alright, so we're at my Spirit Halloween 2023 in Minecraft, as you can know. Yeah, this is what the video is about, so, yeah. Um, okay. Well, let's go in. Let's give a review of 2023. So, here's the front archway. Here's Stilts, Leatherface, Martian, this is the middle part. Uh, Widow, Slim, Poor George. Dagger Mike and Joy Sing Scarecrow. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention this. I put the thing in the roof. So, yeah. Uh, over here we have Cauldronus, Emmeline, 
Heckles, which is probably my favorite design, and Little Jack Carver. We got some side stuff, more side stuff right there. You know, costumes and stuff in the back. And here's the back part, the front part of the back. Uh, so here's Hallspawn, Howling Spirit, the Gargoyle, Starling Dolly, Eternal Rest, Gordo, the Black Heart, uh, Grave Watcher, Desmodus. Little scally bones, jumping spider. Oh, uh, that was the best timing I've had. And like the backdrop. So yeah, that was just a quick review. More, you know, more side stuff. Uh oh so yeah, up here. So I was gonna make it really tall and pretty dark, but when I did that it was really hard to build, so I just had to make it lower and just kinda make a weird section up here. But uh yeah. But yeah, I think I think the section's really cool. You can see like the roof up here. It's pretty dark up here. But yeah, make sure to leave a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh subscribe to the channel with notifications on, that way you never miss a video if you haven't already. Share with your friends and family, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.